Hi everyone and welcome. So for today's video I'm going to show you my artwork that I did in college. So in college I took four art classes, fundamentals which is beginner art, art appreciation, drawing, and painting. A lot of the painting work won't be shown until like the end of this video. You'll kind of get a glimpse of them. So I started off with some still lives and then a sketch of the, the first painting we did in painting class. This was just a bunch of random art notes and on the right side we were learning about different line thicknesses and I drew this girl and uh, she be thick because we were learning about like thick lines and thin lines so I just kind of sketched a thick girl. This is a more art notes and then I was really into drawing dragons. So you'll see this dragon with a couple notes and then this one, which I, I'm kind of proud of this one. And here I was working with ink for the first time, which is like watercolor. And I did one of my favorite pieces, which is this skull and a rose on kind of a brick thing. Look at how amazing this thing is. I love this. If I knew how to make prints, I would sell prints of this because I love it. It's my favorite. I love everything about it. Like overall, it's just, <sighs> I'll, I'll talk about this all the time if I could, but we're moving on for the video. Next, some more kind of thumbnails. This was thumbnails of a project I did. I did the bottom one, the butterflies and the flowers. I couldn't find the finished product, so I, but here I drew this. It says 2017. I know you can't see it very well, but it looks exactly like the Meg, like the movie cover, and that didn't come out until August 2018. Look at how similar this is, and I didn't watch trailers or anything about it. This is this is scary, freaky, like, oh my gosh, which I like the Meg. It's a good movie, but this is some more thumbnails. Um, at the top that I'm covering up is something that I want to work on like this year, like soon. It's a project I will talk more about in another video, maybe, but some more art notes and plans for future pieces. This is some perspective drawing with just some, like a cube. Some more perspective drawing and then some more art notes. This is some thumbnails for a project. Um, you'll see it later. This is some more thumbnails and then kind of like a fighting scene. I don't know. That's random, but you know, that's what sketchbooks are for. Some more thumbnails. Most of the sketchbook is thumbnails. That was big in college that I had to do thumbnails. So this piece you'll see later. It's a little, like I changed it a little differently, but this is some thumbnails for a commission and then some dragonflies. So that's it for that sketchbook. And now we're gonna do some magic in three, two, one. Is it, yay, see, I'm magic. Isn't that cool? So here's some more. Some of the, most of these are not for college. This was life drawing, like when I was in college, but we went to like a museum. So when I did some life drawing, that's just a friend that was sitting across from me. We did some funny poses. And the rest of this sketchbook is not copied, but inspired, I guess, by other artists. So if you see something similar like this on the internet, Probably, because I just use this for, like, practice. Practice using color pencils or inks or stuff like that. But here, I worked on a color pencil piece. I ripped out of here, but you can see the remnants of it on that side. I did my Morgan Freeman. This is one of my favorite pieces I did. Look at how detailed this thing is. It's my favorite thing that, yes, my favorite thing ever. Oh my gosh, it's so detailed. I am so happy with how that looked. Like, really. And 
this is a finished portrait that I didn't finish. An unfinished portrait, sorry. And the rest of this stuff is, besides that, is just kind of loose sketches. <sighs> sorry. That, the drafts I did life drawing, like I went to the zoo and drew them. And I drew those fish, but I didn't color them. I... The rest of this is just kind of loose sketches, and then what's colored in crayon, um, some children colored in my sketchbook, because I think it's okay to let, like, children color in my sketchbook, I guess. This is so funny. I laugh at it every time. It says, no more Twitter for you. You hurt America's feelings. And then the guy says, wrong. Can you guys guess who that is? It's funny. And the rest is the children kind of took over my sketchbook. So that's that sketchbook. Moving on. Now this one. Um, what's in this one? I forgot. Oh, this is just a few just kind of quick sketches. That's part of the commission I was working on. Some more part of the commission. Some just random doodles and sketches. And that's it. See, look, the Morgan Freeman. I copied it and I painted and I, like, taped it on here. Yay, that looks good. This is a very detailed ink piece of, like, a guy in Orma. Very proud of this piece. I love drawing in ink. I need to get back into it. And to pair up with this dude, I drew a girl in Orma. She's fancy with a horned crown so a random sketch and then a sketch I didn't finish a girl holding a fox and that's it for that one this is a very detailed ink piece I am so proud of this one as well this took so long a lot of those are like dot 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 yeah yeah forever but I didn't finish it because I spilt some oil painting medium at the bottom corner right there. And I didn't want to finish it because it was ruined. So, yeah. And I didn't want to, like, cut that piece off because it would cut off part of the ink. So, yeah. Unfinished but very detailed piece. I'm so sad that I messed it up. A unfinished portrait. I might finish it, but... Oh, I'm yawning. <laughs> Sorry. This is the hallway of my college. Kind of by the art classroom. Random sketch. Um, The girl falling. We kind of had to do like a mixed media piece. So this is printmaking. So we just kind of like stamps kind of I guess. But yeah, it's patterns. And then I helped make this print. So that was fun. This is one of my pieces from painting class. It's pretty big. This is my first oil painting I did. And all of these are big pieces. So that's why it's on my bed. Sorry for the shaking camera. This is Vincent Van Gogh's Story Night. It is an impression of like a skull. These are just some bottles. This is a wooden box, a wooden heart, and a cup. A lot of this stuff is still lives, you'll see. See, another impressionistic still life. It's wrinkled because it's like wet medium. I just used the wrong paper. This is a hallway. Next is a carousel horse. I didn't finish, but I was proud of what I did there. So next is kind of, I think it's a candle. This was a still life that was in class. I mean, lots and lots and lots of charcoal. And then this is a black and white. It's a statue of a lady holding a baby. Next statue of a lady, and it ha she had like a rose in her eye. And this is one of my favorite pieces as well. It's titled First Love, 
and it's a statue of just a boy and a girl. So, and that's it in that big book. 